Hi, first graders, it's Miss O'Reilly. Today we are going to be reviewing the floss rule. Before we begin, you might be thinking, I know what floss is. It's a really funny dance. Or maybe you're thinking about the floss that you use when you try to clean in between your teeth. Today we're going to be thinking about the floss rule for word work. This rule teaches us to double the final consonant in a word when these three things are all true. Number one, the word is one syllable. Number two, the word has a short vowel. Number three, the word ends in the letters F, L, S, or sometimes Z. Did you know the word floss actually follows the floss rule? Think about what sounds these letters make. The consonants F, L, S, and Z, and the vowels A, E, I, O, and U. When we read short vowels, they say A, E, I, A, U. It's important that we know the difference between a short vowel sound and a long vowel sound. Let's think about what the floss rule looks like. When we read these words, we can sound them out like this. P, a, uh, f, puff. H, i, o, hill. G, a, s, glass. F, i, z, fizz. I just read the words puff, hill, glass, and fizz. Do you notice anything special about the endings of each of these words? If you notice that the letters F, L, S, and Z are all doubled, great work. That's exactly what the floss rule is. Now it's time for us to practice. Can you read this word in a clear, loud voice? Think about the beginning sound, what short vowel sound the word has, and what the end sound is. Try to read the word on the screen. If you read the word p, i, o, pill, great job! Can you read this word in a clear, loud voice? B, e, o, bell. Nice job! Let's practice reading this word. M, i, s. Miss. Great work! Let's practice some more words. Can you read this word? If you read the word b, a, z, buzz, great job! Let's try reading a few more floss words. I know a lot of first graders know how to read this word because they love to play this game. Try sounding it out. Did you read ch, a, s, chess? Awesome! Did you notice that there is also a digraph at the beginning of chess? We practiced this last week with Miss Delaney. Let's read this word. Can you read it? Kiss. Mwah. Great job, first graders! You just read so many floss words! Great work! Now let's think about some exceptions to the rule. Like many rules in English, the floss rule has some exceptions. The floss rule does not apply when s sounds like z, like at the end of is, his, was, and has. The floss rule does also not apply to these sight words. Thus, us, if, this, yes, gas. You just have to know them. Let's quickly review. Remember, the floss rule teaches us to double the final consonant in a word when these three things are all true. The word is one syllable. The word has a short vowel. The word ends in the letters F, L, S, 
or Z. Well done, first graders. Today, you practiced reading words that follow the floss rule. Later this week, you will practice applying the floss rule when you write. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Bye.